Ladies and gentlemen, that is Miss Jennifer Hudson in our background. She's singing about mountains being high enough. Song originally done by that uh, young man named Marvin Gaye and that Miss Terrell Tammy person, and then done by Michael McDonald and a couple of other people, but ain't no mountain high enough. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, ladies, ladies and gents, just wanted to take the short time. Look, a young lady called me today. She said, you know, I sent it out and I got one back. And, and then when I sent it out and I got one back, I don't know why they sent the other one back and they accepted the other one. And because it, and I said, excuse me, hold on. First of all, should you not have said, hey, Eon, uh, appreciate you taking my call. Do, do you have a moment? I, I have something interesting I'd like to tell you. I said, should you not have started the conversation off that way? Would that not have been a little bit respectful? Well, I, I'm sorry if I offended, excuse me. Nobody said anything about offensive. I said, would it not have been respectful? Would it not have been the thing to do? Do you see, I'm working on a motion that I have to put into the court. As a matter of fact, I got to upload that motion in a moment. But I'm working on a motion. And because I'm working on this motion, I got a bunch of other things that I'm dealing with right now. Plus, I'm completing a video about how to file a complaint against financial institutions, i.e. banks. And so I'm completing that. So should you not have asked me if I was busy, if I had a moment to speak? Well, are you busy? Well, yes, I am. But what could I do for you? Literally gave me attitude. Now, I know in her mind, she doesn't think she gave me attitude. No, no, in her mind, I'm supposed to drop everything that I was doing just to hear her because, wait, hold on. She was a little excited. She had some success. But she didn't start off the conversation by saying she had some success. I thought she had an issue, a problem. She was trying to work out something. She got one of her bills paid by doing the change of address. Ladies and gentlemen, hold on. Um, okay, now I put in change of address. And what I want to find, this video right here. Now, ladies and gentlemen, when I did this video, you guys need to understand, I'm not just putting out information that I think will work, okay? A credit repair process that works. Hold on, hold on, hold on, everyone, hold on. Again, I'm not just putting out a video of things that I think will work. I'm giving you information on things that I know work, okay? I, I don't have time to do this myself, but I had already proved that it worked. I did it, and I showed you guys in the video. It's only 37 minutes long. Go watch it. You don't owe me anything. I'm not asking you to pay me for this information. What I asked you guys for, hey, thank you for contributing because I needed your help so that I could put out more information like that, and have I not been putting out that type of information? But when I put my number on the internet, I told all of you, you're calling me. Respect my time. The first, I promise you, ladies and gentlemen, I'm not going to put a copy of the recording up on the internet. That won't happen. But I promise you, the very first thing I said, what can I do for you? And the moment she just started going on and on and on and on and on and on and on. And I'm like, wait, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Do you think you should have asked me if I was busy, if I... If I was doing something, if I, if, you know, if I could take your call, if I had a moment, or is it possible for you to call me back or anything like that? Nothing. She just started with the conversation. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't work that way. I asked you all if I put my number out there to respect my time. So at least ask me if I have the time. Okay, I promise you I don't. I've been working all day today trying to get that information out today today trying to get the information out to you guys about following complaints about letting you know these are final steps okay file your complaints against these morons and i'm sorry i said i was going to tone it down with calling them names so i apologize i apologize to the morons for calling them morons you guys will have to pardon me ladies and gentlemen the following now remember these two are today these were done today it is three o'clock i've been up since eight because i got up at 4 30 
No, I got up at 4, went back to sleep at 5.15, and woke up at 8. So I did get my sleep, and I need that type of waking up and going back to sleep. I need to literally sleep for a couple of hours after I wake up. That was fine, because normally I wake up and I can't go back to sleep. So that was perfect. But waking up at 8 o'clock, I lost an hour today, because I normally start working at 8. Serious working. Other than that, I'm letting myself prepare. Seven days a week. Now, look, it's not up to you to determine, oh, I know you're busy and I know that you got. Don't worry about knowing. You have no idea. You cannot. I, I got my cameras. They're taped off. You cannot see me and my camera. So how do you know? I'm sorry. Stop assuming. Just simply, hey, Eon, how you doing? First, my name is such and such, such and such. Look, I know that I'm calling you. I just out of the blue. You didn't know I was going to call you. Hey. Are you busy? Do you have a moment to talk? Really, you do? Okay, sure. Can I can I explain my situation to you? Really? Okay, here's what's going on. Now, I'm going to give you the short version because I know the long version would, you know, <laughs> that would take too long. So I'm going to give you the short version. Is that okay? Oh, sure. Oh, oh I could ask you uh, for more information later. If, if you have questions, then I could say, hey, you mind if I explain some more and you'll let me if you have time? Oh, thank you. Oh, dude, no, uh, no, 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 I appreciate that. Okay, oh, can, can I start? Okay, here it is. This is what, okay, conversations that go like that. Oh, man, you guys take a lot of weight off of me because I am so stressed out having to deal with these agencies and these people playing stupid with me. Oh, but when you guys come at me and you say, hey, look here, here look here, chump. Uh, this is my situation. I don't get what you're going through, but this is what I'm going through. So you better understand what I'm going through means a whole lot more to me than what you're going through. You understand me, fool? You see, that's how some of you come at me. And then you get that attitude, the same attitude I give to them officials. Look, it looked like he got stabbed in the heart, huh? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I just thought I'd explain, you know, that that's all. That's all I wanted to do. I just wanted to explain, you know, because some people won't understand it. And sometimes you need to get an understanding. I'm just changing the, the pictures on some of them because those were three pictures in a row because I did three videos in a row. Whew! And I don't want the same pictures on all of them. All right? So y'all don't mind, do y'all, if I change my pictures because I feel like it? Okay, thank you very much. All right, ladies and gentlemen, hey, have a good day. Have a good life. And know that all of the documents that I promised were up, they're up on the site. All of them. Okay, because I, I did it. I put them up there. So all of the documents are up. Please go take a look at those documents, all right? Have a good day, everybody. Adios, y'all. Gotta go.